Hi, today we're going to explore how to enter grades and standards using PowerTeacher. First, you'll want to access PowerSchools. You can find this on the homepage at dvusd.net. You can also find it on the portal. For now, I'm just going to click on our PowerSchools menu. Here, it'll take you to the production servers. You'll want to click on Teachers. This will bring you to the Power Teacher Sign In page. You'll want to enter your username and password and then click Sign In. Next, you'll want to go over to Navigation and click on Gradebook. From here, you'll want to scroll down and click on Launch Power Teacher Gradebook. If you're running in Google Chrome, you will get a pop up. You'll want to select Keep and then also click on Launch. If you get a security warning, you'll want to click on Run. This will bring you to your home screen. You'll find all of your content areas on the upper left hand corner. To switch to your different content areas, simply click on the content areas. At the top you'll see score sheet, assignments, student info, grade setup, class content, reports, attendance, and notifications. You'll add your assignment by clicking on the plus tab. This will bring you to your new assignment page. Here you'll enter in the name, abbreviation, category, and possible points. You'll want to add in the due date and if you'd like you can add in a description as well. One of the features that I like is that after you enter the name you can hit tab and it will give you your uh, abbreviation automatically. Next you'll want to choose which category. Classwork automatically sets to 10 points possible however you can change that. When you're ready to add in your standards you click on standards here it'll give you a list of all the standards in that area. I'm going to choose gather and use information through research. Once you have chosen your standard you'll want to click on save and then X out the screen. Now you're ready to add in your grades. You'll want to select the cell with the specific student in mind and enter your grade. If you're one of the grade levels that need to put standards in, you'll go up to your S with an arrow and click on it. Here, you'll be able to add in your standard scores 1 through 4. A 1 in the standard means that that student falls far below the standard with little progress. A 2 means that student approaches the standard. They're performing below grade level with support. A 3 means the student meets the standard and is performing at grade level. A 4 means that the student exceeds the standard. Independently, they're performing above grade level. Once you have put in all your scores, you'll want to click Save. I'd like to thank you for taking the time to explore PowerTeacher with me. Have a wonderful day and happy grading.